process of running live data through a trained AI model can be quite slow and requires a lot of resources. Not only does it cost a lot, but it can be quite code intensive. This is where I introduce Inference Engine, the fastest inference available. Just take a look at this example where the world's fastest inference stack is operating. The prompt given to the Llama 2 chat model is tell me about San Francisco and you can see on the screen that's able to generate the content very fast and efficiently which totals up to 512 tokens and it was based off of a token usage per second of 114 which is extremely fast and efficient. This basically means that it is up to three times faster than TGI or V large language model when running on the same hardware. It's also up to two times faster than other services, whether that's APIs from Perplexity, AnyScale, Fireworks AI, or Mosaic. Now this means that the most demanding generative AI applications in the world can now provide a much faster user experience with greater efficiency as well as lower costs and this is something that we're going to explore throughout today's video as we take a look at Inference Engine further in detail as we explore some of the benchmarks, take a look at the background as well as how you can get started with Together AI's Inference Engine. So with that thought guys, thank you guys so much for watching and let's get straight to the video. If you are not a part of our private discord, you are definitely missing out. We give out paid subscriptions for AI tools for free guys. You're able to get amazing knowledge, different types of courses, research papers, as well as different networking and consulting opportunities. If you're interested in any of this, definitely take a look at the link in the description below as it will definitely elevate your AI game. Now, if you guys haven't followed World of AI on Twitter, I highly recommend that you do so so you can stay up to date with the latest AI news. And lastly, make sure you guys subscribe, turn notification bell, like this video, and check out our previous videos so you can stay up to date with the latest AI news. Hey guys, I started this new thing where if you want to book a one-on-one -on -one with me, you can definitely do so with the link in the description below. I can be giving you my consulting in various different aspects, whether that's AI related, entrepreneurship, and so much more. So if you're interested in this, definitely take a look at the link in the description below. Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video at the world of AI. In today's video, we're going to take a look at together.ai's new inference method, which is the fastest inference available. Now, the objective of this project is to create a robust, scalable, user-friendly, and exceptionally fast endpoint for open models such as Llama 2, as well as Mistral. Now, achieving this goal is no small feat, and I'm highly impressed by the team's efforts to create something like this. Now the Together Inference Engine is constructed on CUDA and we can see that it runs on NVIDIA's Tensor Core GPUs. Now in the recent months, the team was able to collaborate with other partners and they have introduced various techniques including Flash Attention 2, they have Flash Decoding, as well as Medusa. Now all of these things optimize the inference's performance and this is why it was able to get so effective and efficient over the time. Now these techniques are not only open source but have also been integrated in numerous libraries which is available for many. Now this is by combining these optimizations with their own and the team was able to basically announce this new inference engine which has incorporated all of these different types of libraries and they have basically made it so that the inference engine is possibly the best and fastest method for you to process different types of chat models. Now let's take a look at the performance for the Llama 2 13 billion chat model as well as the other model sizes of Llama, for example the 70 billion chat model. Now in this case, the performance of the Together Inference Engine was basically assessed transparently using the newly introduced open source LM Perfection benchmark and this was something that harnessed any scale. Now this benchmark was configured with default settings where the input average was around 500 tokens and it was able to average 150 output tokens. Now this evaluation involved comparing the performance of Together Inference's engine with TGI as well as via LLM under the default LLM perf settings. And we can see over here from the original paragraph, they had stated that it is up to three times faster than TGI and via LLM when on, running on the same hardware. And we can see this with the graph over here. You have the bar graph that 
basically showcases together inference engine with the blue color tgi as the orange or red color as well as the vllm with the yellow color and you can see that it is outscaling all of these different uh bar or like not bars but these other engines by a mile away which is absolutely amazing to see now we can also see the same similar results with the llama 2 70 billion chat model it's able to outperform all of these other engines which is really really nice to see now these next few graphs are focusing on the together inference api compared to perplexity as well as any skill apis with default lm perf settings and this is basically just a comparison aimed to provide a clear understanding on the performance difference amongst these different systems whether that's perplexity or any skill or together ai and together ai is able to outperform all of them as we expected with this new engine on the llama 2 13 billion chat and we can see the same results with the 70 billion chat continuing the evaluation the performance of together's inference api was further compared to that of perplexity as well as of any scale apis but this time it was using modified lm perp settings now these modified settings involved an average output of 700 tokens and this was an average generation of 550 output tokens now this adjustment was aimed to explore how the system was fair under a different set of conditions which provides a more comprehensive assessment of the capabilities and yet again uh, we see together ai's new engine outperforming perplexity and any skill with both models the 13 billion llama chat model as well as the llama 2 70 billion chat model let us emphasize on the quality now when they had constructed the together inference engine they had made sure that there would be any there wouldn't be any compromise to the quality now we know that there's certain methods such as quantization which can alter the model's behavior but the improvements here are that they avoided such changes by avoiding that method now in terms of accuracy the provided table we see over here is demonstrating that Together's inference delivers the results comparable to the well-regarded hugging face implementation. This underscores that the speed improvements do not compromise the accuracy of this model, which is absolutely insane. Now let's emphasize a little bit on the pricing. Now what they have done is that they've tried to reduce the computational resources that are used when they're running inferences and they basically are thrilled to pass on these efficiencies to you and they basically were able to form quite affordable rates now this is something that's effective as of today where they're slashing their price of the serverless endpoint for the 70 billion model for the llama 2 70 billion chat model 13 billion chat model as well as the 7 billion chat model they were able to slash it to only 0 0.0009 for a thousand tokens, which is really useful for a lot of people who are running inferences. This basically means that you're able to leverage models like Llama 2, 13 million chat, at the cost of six times lower than GPT's 3.5 Turbo. This is all while enjoying the performance that is 1.85 times faster. This updated pricing is something that is for the Llama 2 models currently. They're going to be working towards other models later on. And this is something that you can take a look at on the pricing page. So if you're interested in this, definitely take a look at this so you can get a better idea before you start running together AI's inference engine. Now, I just want to emphasize on some of the cool features. We talked about this before, which is the serverless endpoints. You're able to host 50 plus top open source models like Llama 2, Red Pajama, Falcon, as well as stable diffusion models. Now you're automatically able to scale these with traffic, removing the need to choose instance types. You only pay for what you use, and it's based off the sum of inputs as well as the outputs per token. Another amazing feature is the dedicated instances. You're able to deploy for 100 plus popular open source models, fine tuned models, or proprietary models. This is tailored for hardware configuration as well as controlling instance deployment as well as auto scaling. It gives you dynamic optimization for the tokens that are used per second as well as overall throughput. Another feature is the auto scaling feature where you're able to configure auto scaling for both serverless endpoints and dedicated instances. Automatically provisions are additional to the hardware 
during the high API volumes, which allows you to provision such like resources during the actual instances. Now there's additional models as well as they have now over a hundred models that are available since their launch. You're able to use models like News Hermes, you have Lemma, Mistral, which is a really powerful small parameter model. And you're able to see that they're continuously working on expanding their model library, which shows that Together AI has been doing a great job over the weeks, months to develop such amazing tech that is out there for you guys. So I'll leave all these links in the description below. And if you're interested, you can definitely request another video with me on Together AI, showcasing this engine further more in detail. Now, if you're interested, you can definitely get started right now. By creating an account, you can definitely do so by clicking on the get started button. You can connect your Google account, GitHub account, or you can just create it with your email. Now you can see that there's many different things that you can do, but you can simply go onto the chat model and you're able to set different things such as language, image, code, fine tune. And you can see that they have a tutorial on how you can get started with different models. So if you're interested in this, I highly recommend that you check out their documentation so you can get a better idea. But if you want me to make a dedicated video for this, I can definitely do so later on so that you can get a better idea as to how you can use this new together inference engine but with that thought guys thank you guys so much for watching i really really appreciate it i'll leave all these links in the description below make sure you check out the twitter page if you guys haven't already definitely give this a follow if you guys want to join our private discord you can do so with the patreon link in the description below and lastly make sure you guys subscribe turn on notification bell like this video and check out our previous videos so you can stay up to date with the latest ai news with that thought guys thank you guys so much for watching have an amazing day and i'll see you guys fairly shortly peace out fellas